Hey everyone and welcome back to Satisfactory. Uh, off camera I uh, got enough resources together, a lot of it by hand, a lot of it with a couple assemblers, to get our tier 3 coal power uh, milestone set up. And that's going to be a huge thing for us. Milestone <coughs> reach. Coal is an improved alternative power source to biomass. Yes it is. I still think coal is going to be up there. The uh, I don't need to. Okay, okay, okay. I don't need to read how to do that. So, I want to scan for coal, and we're going to see where it is. And see just how far away it is. Seven hundred, eight hundred, nine hundred meters. Wow, that's so far away. Um. Wow. Yeah, there's one on guarantee on top of that hill. So, how much concrete do we actually have? Because with you know, we have tons here. I want to see once if can we walk, please. If we can zoop our way up to this, because it's going to be. Directly up on top of this hill, I think, right? And I gotta go into zero. And how do I? Can I pick what what I want? E. So it's yeah, that's the closest one. So I want to go into Q. Nope. Uh, Q, right? Okay, Q foundations, and we want to do a ramp. We're not gonna have that much actually to go off of here. We're gonna, oh, whoops, uh, build mode is what? Or, zoop. I'm gonna zoop this up as high as I can reach. I need to get some more plates before we keep doing this. Because that I don't want to run out of. Um, there's two plates. That should be enough. Look at that. That's awesome. And I don't know if we have how easily we can go above this gas. I know you can go above it. I just don't know what the limit is. And I don't even know exactly how high we got to go, but I think Q. I'm what? Is Q not the right button? What did I, what did I just do? Uh, oh, there we go. Okay. That was weird. So we're going to zoop up as much. I mean, you can only go so high with this. Obviously, but as soon as you place it, you can walk it. And we're getting there. Actually, we are. Oh, I see. Because between here. Oh, there's a slug there. Where's their bad guy at? There's none on here. So the gas is over there. Yeah, so there's actually a break right in here. But let's just scan one more time to see. I think it's right on top of this hill, right? As soon as it touches the top of the mountain, yeah, 400 meters. So that's actually fine. So we're going to go zoop. I think you can only go up. I guess it is 10. Like this is so far up in the air. If I'd fall off of this, I sure will die. But this is the way to go around stuff like this. I think we should still need to go up some more. And then eventually you're going to have to. Oh, look, there's something. Oh, what's over there? Is that limestone? Oops. Oh, how many limestones? There's three limestones. Look at that. That's actually not that far from our base. wonder why I didn't know they were there before. Oh, I wonder if that's... Is that oil down there? I don't remember what the oil looks like. If this is where the oil is or if that's something totally different. But I think we still need to go up a little bit here. So we're going to go up a few more. I have enough for about another hundred. We do have to... Oh, wow. That's cool. We're at like the, the edge of like this biome. I think that's the edge of the map. Like the, the world map, I think. Unless this is my view distance. Which also could be it. And then here we're just going to hit zero. We're just going to zoop this as far as I can go. And let's just get over here. Why am I not running? I guess it just feels like I'm going slow. And I want to zoom. This is like the best feature in the game is this zooping thing. 
because it makes stuff like this so possible. Because before you had to do one by one by one by one, and oh my gosh, it took forever. Oh, I'll try this. I remember it should be right on the other side of this. These trees. What? That says power slug over there. How would you even get to? I guess you would have the the Blade Runner boots. I think it's literally right over here. Because I remember and and yeah, it's right on here. There's, there's actually three there. That in in the old game is you'd have to get your way up here by going up through this the, the smoke um or building a ramp up to here like one by one by one uh the zooping thing is is super handy and then we're gonna zoop out a couple i don't know how many i actually need to go out because i want to get over to here i guess i could always turn this but that was just gonna get janky won't it I mean, again, it doesn't matter because we can run belts over top of everything. That doesn't, that's not the issue here. So that's going to zoop to there, and we should probably go up. I should probably set up some sort of like. Um, should I just go up here, maybe? Nope. There. I think that would work, right? No, I don't remember if there's there is something right there. I think it's one of those dog things. Look at that. What a <laughs> it'd be nice to be able to go one straight shot, which you may end up doing. It's just it's keeping in line with what we have now, right? So Alright, so we're gonna go back to this ramp and we're actually going to get out of this. And we have a dog right there. I think it's one of those dog things, right? Uh let's um I, mean, I could probably go right on top of it, actually. But we can get back on here if we need to. Let's see, where is he? There's actually two. Oh, there's like more than two. Uh, they take two hits. Okay, that's not hard then. So there is a few. There's coal right here. There's actually a couple more of those dog things right there. Maybe we could just like avoid them all together, right? Because you know, I hate combat, so. Ooh, that's a little sketchy there, isn't it? Let's um, let's go up a little bit here. Let's just go up one more. I mean, obviously the dog thing can't reach us, so. We'll go back to zero. And we'll zoop it that way. Now, can I cut this tree down? That's the next question here. Oops, uh, tab. I can, look at that. Oh no, you can't. Hey, you can. Yes, that's exactly what I want. How about tree? And that other dog things are up here. I gotta be careful here though. Um, I'm not sure where that is. So there's coal here, here, and here. There's three. The other one is is right on the other side of this this thing over here. Which those stupid dogs are there, but and there's one over there. Cool. So we can actually grab it um, right here now. The question is, do we have miners? Can we make a couple miners? We can't. We need to make portable miners. Um, can we make a workshop? Uh, where what is that under? Is it equipment workshop or craft bench? Uh, I think it's a craft bench. You can just put it right here. It doesn't really matter. Uh, no, not the craft bench. Well, we can leave the craft bench there. Uh, let's see. Let's go back into this. We need the equipment workshop, which we can stick it right. I can make this, right? Yeah, there, okay. So what we need to make is we need to make three of these, which should not be a big deal at all, actually. One, two, and then three. And that's all we need. And we want to tap these. I can probably reach that one, can I? 
That's one, and I'm pretty sure I should be able to grab this one. Where is it? Oh, it's all over there. There, and then grab this one. Here. Cool. And obviously we'll need... Oh, do we actually have... Hold, oh, right, you have the coal... Hold on. So you have... Again, this is different than what I, I'm used to. So you have the coal... Oh, oh, power. You have the coal generator, but the coal generator needs water. So the best thing to do is to drag this, the coal, all the way down and set up a place to do it at, which makes sense, right? We can run all the wires. We can set all that stuff up now. And we can put one here. Run that to this. Run this to... Or is this run that there and then run that to here and run that to there and then this can just be run uh, how far can it reach can it reach over to there can it reach to I'll have to redo that when I get down there and then belts to we oh yeah I don't know how much iron we actually have not a lot so ooh, can I why can I not grab that I can here. It's just gonna clip. Oh, um, this can just kind of loop around like that, right? And then I want to put um, a merger, right? Kind of. Can I stick it on that? I can line it up to this. That should be sufficient. And then, yeah, I'm gonna need to make more belts. That's gonna go in like that. And again, this is. We're going to be way over, where is that other one at? It is, let it click please there. I um, guess I could put a merger here, right? Uh, nine. That's fine. And that's cool, that's hooked up, great. This can stay, doesn't really, yeah, we, we have one, we have one belt left. Uh, this is cool. So power grid, yeah, so this is all ready to go. It just has to be hooked up, obviously. And it's gonna need a lot of power to hook it up. Um, what I actually wanted to do is grab that and run it to this outside corner. Does it reach to that? Can I put it right there? And then that goes away. And then just run this. I guess as far as it goes, but this is awesome though. See, this is what I'm talking about as, as far as building way up in the air where there's nothing here. How far can that reach? Because you basically bypass all the bad guys. They can build it to you. And I'm glad that you can put it on this corner. I think previous versions of the game, you couldn't, um, you couldn't put them on the edge like that. You had to put them like here, unless I'm wrong. Um, but it's so glad you can do that and they actually fit well too. I'm like, oh no, do I want to I'm just gonna run Run this all the way down That is a little sketchy. We can slide though It's a long way to go, but you know what I mean we're actually gonna be going over there, but for we could, you know, we could, we, I don't want to fall over that. But in my last episode, if you guys, well, you do remember, I said about moving the base, but what we can do is we could actually use this base here to, I mean, you can use it as like a bit of a smelting hub, uh, I guess, right? It wouldn't hurt, but only do, oh, well, I'm out of, uh, I'm out of line, so that's fine. We could actually do this as our power area, which I think would kind of be cool. I can't build any of that either. So we are out of everything. Not really, but I can't believe I ran out of plate. That's kind of crazy. Rods, fine with me. Just need more cables too. And this stuff should just be backed up because I'm not making. Yeah, I don't need any of this. I need cables. I do need so that I will take. If we can grab that and just stick that right here. And now what I need to do is I need to run some. I don't know if that's going to be enough, 200. 
and this is only a Mark One belt, right? So we we can we can make Mark Two belts. What are they? Oh, they take reinforced. So yeah, we're not we're not anywhere near that yet, and I don't even want to mess with it. I think the goal for this, the rest of this episode, is this any faster jumping? I don't think so. The goal for this episode is to get coal down here, which this isn't going to be a waste then. We can leave the space elevator here. We can set this area up eventually to be like a big smelting area because we have the line smoon. And then almost run, I guess, some sort of like a bus. Like a busing system, which I've never, I don't think I've ever used that in the game before. I mean, I, looking back on it, I guess I have a little bit, right? Um, you you run, I mean, I'm running the coal here, and I could run this three three or two two belts high if I wanted to. But I think for now, I just want to get one consistent flow in, and then once we get power, at least somewhat established with coal... We can then really start thinking about. There's another one over. Oh, it's the same one. Really? Wow, look at that. That looks super cool up there. Wow. And you can hear the waterfall. So awesome. Like, I love the game. It's, it's a beautiful game. Um, if the bad things, the bad, even even like the gas, the gas can stay. Because that's a passive attack thing that'll attack you. It's not, it's not, it, it's, it's passive. It, it's not, um,. Aggressive is that the? I guess that'd be the other the other word for it. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna run this to here and then run that down to. Uh, can we run it? Uh, I guess we're gonna run it along. That works. I don't think I can run it on the. Yeah, I can run it on the edge, but we'll just run it as far. Well, not as far as we can. We're gonna run it to here. And then we're going to run this to here. And I remember you go two back. And then you go that. So it would be one, two. To give you a nice... That's not a 90 degree angle, is it? <laughs> I was going to say a nice 90 degree angle. But I think that only works if you're trying to run things... Oh, well, that one worked, though. Weird. Now, as soon as we get this hooked up, actually, we are going to have coal coming in, which is awesome. I always forget you got to double click. Like you click once to, well, I'll show you. You click, I'm going to run out of. So you click once and then you can do the height. You can raise the height. Um, but it's too long going that way because you're actually adding some to it. And you click again and yeah, we're not going to have enough to get down to where we're going. But that's, how is that going to clip there? It shouldn't clip at all, really. Uh, I can go to here. I guess it's a bit... That should flow straight down though, right? I guess not because of how it works. And I think I'm just out of something, yeah. So let's go back down and get some plate and we can do... Go the fast way. Can we jump? Oh, wait, that is going to hurt me. Uh, yeah. Whoops. <laughs> anyway. We're almost there, right? And I sh should... I should actually cut some of the the processes of this stuff because I'm not I don't need it. Let me just see what our power supply is right now. Cause it just has to well, we need a yeah, we don't well we still need reinforced plate. But how are we doing? We're okay on power, really. Let's uh let's hook this up and let's see what happens. If it if it kills our power, then we'll unhook it. Or disconnect it. Let's see what just happened. Well, miners don't take that much power anyway, and that's all we're doing is, is bringing in more miners, right? So this plate's going in. This plate is, is working, but it's not going anywhere. So that's 90. Uh, oops, can I go this way, please? Oh, that's right. I only have that one anymore. No, this one's making... Let's just making screws now. Um, yeah, okay. We only have 90. Um... I can make a bunch. It seems really foolish to do that by hand, but I want to get the coal down here, I guess. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough. Wow, look at that. Well, that looks totally ridiculous, right? I mean, it'd be, it'd be cool at some point to make this into like a, a factory with walls and everything. Wow, we're super far away. I wonder how far away I can grab this. Well, obviously, not that far. 
I think you can reach the distance of a power pole, right? I'm not sure if that's 100% accurate or not. But I think you can reach... Yeah, I can't... Ooh. There you go. I f Ooh, that's... What? Oh, it's just too long. Okay. Should be able to go to, what, to here, right? I don't know why it says it's going to clip there. Oh. It's not. And this should... I don't know what's clipping there, right? It says it's clipping, but it's not really. Oh, uh, this is awesome, though. We're actually making progress to where I'm happy with the progress. I don't know what's actually clipping here. Oh, there goes the power. We definitely ran out of something. It's not because we overloaded the system. We just definitely ran out of something. And we'll have just enough to get... Well, not all the way to here, I guess. Cool. So I got pipes, we have all kinds of stuff. But this is great though. I'm very happy with the progress that we've made this episode. Um, in the last episode, we kind of just talked about doing stuff. But it's important to kind of, uh, let's just get some biomass. <clears throat> but it's important to talk about plans, right? And I mean, yeah, I could just do it off camera, but I'd rather share it with you guys. Kind of share my uh, my thought process here. And right now is to get biomass to keep the power running because we got to start hooking up the water things and the pipes and learn how to do that because I've never done the stuff with the with the water before. So that can go in there. This can go in there. The fabric can go in there. This and this can go in there. And then. I guess that's it. The rest we can sort. So let's see which one is broken. No, or not broken. It's not going to be these. It's going to be one of these. It's probably going to be the one with yellow on it. Oh no. Dump that in there. Dump this in here. And might as well dump that into that one. Let's crank it back up. We should be fine now. Yeah, we are producing 81. Well, I guess you're producing as much as you're consuming. Now, I know there's a setting. It's not. I think you have to get it. One of the researches. That's weird. Um, where you can like, uh, I'm not sure. Throttle down the speeds on, on certain things. I'm not sure what that's. Is that, maybe that's the overclocking or the underclocking. Yes, yeah, it's, it's something in here. You can change this to make it like a perfect ratio, which I don't. I, I guess I understand it. But then I kind of don't understand it because it's like, what's the difference if it's producing um, more than what you, you, you want or whatever, right? I don't know. I just want to make some more plate. Does that make sense? Probably not, right? Okay, let's just get... Has the coal made it? Uh, oh, let's see. It's kind of like wavy like that. Has the coal made it this far? I don't think it has yet. It'll take a while. I really am not going to try to find. Oh, and there we go. Cool. Because look at all the stuff in here that we got to now uh, queue. We have to work at making pipelines, supports. Where's actually the pump at? What is that under? This water extractor, we can't make, we don't have any of that stuff. Rotors and those we can make, and then it needs the copper sheets. How do you make copper sheets? Um, oh, God, we have 100 reinforced iron plate. That's so awesome. The rotors we still need again, so I'm going to turn this back on. We should be, oh, right, I totally disconnected this thing, too. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. What? How is that too steep now? What? How is that too? St I don't understand. Cause like it literally worked before, right? Um. Do that and then run that into that. What? How is that even possible? It's not. Please. It's not too steep. I don't understand. Cause I can do it like. I can. 
I can do that. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, it won't let me do that. Um... It worked before, right? That's what frustrates you, me. Turning it doesn't do anything. What if we would just... Oh, is it because that's there? So what if we'd bring it down like that, and then bring this? Yeah, so that, that works, I guess, but doing it the other way, this is still a big cluster, but... So, we'll see what we need to make. So to make the extractors, I don't know what type of ratio we need we need 10 rotors and we need 20 of the copper sheets. I think they're called copper sheets. They take copper ingots. Ah, okay. And then, then we need 10 rotors. So let's make them 10 first. And then um, we actually see what we need for the coal. Like we'll eventually do that stuff like to ratio. It's just we have to start getting, getting power set up. And then so we don't have to worry about power, and then we can start adding things and taking things away without... All right, that's plenty of all we need. And then um, also I want to see what the coal generators take. Ten more rotors. We need ten more. Well, we need 20 in total. So we're going to just can craft those because I have no other way to, to, to craft them, of course. And one more. And I think we need cables. So that I can make. Yeah, I can get to put it down because it just says it generates 75 megawatts. Oh, which is so cool. How many are we actually using right now? Geez, we're barely, we're only using a little bit more than all. Oh, it's going to be so cool to get one of those up and running. And then the other thing is going to be the, the water business, which is under production, I guess. So it needs 20 iron or 20 copper sheets, which we just need ingots for that. Oops, I wanted to slide under that. So the problem is, oh no, it's not a problem, because we can just grab 200 ingots just like that. You can't slide underneath those, can you? Oh, you can. How did I not <laughs> think you could slide underneath the main belts? All right, cool. So we just got to make, oh wait, hold on. Um, how many was it? 20. Where is that under here? You should make pretty fast too, yeah. So we just need 20 of them, and then we can place our water pump. Oh, we need to place uh, the water pipes, which I can't see them taking anything more than iron, right? I mean, obviously, they can't require steel because you need coal for steel, and you need, well, you know what I mean. What did I say? We needed 20, so we have plenty here. And then let's just check one last thing is the, where is that? What, that, what, would, that, what, would, that, what would that be under? Those are cool. Pipes. Pipes. Oh, what? Why do pipes take... What? So that's... A so pipes take copper sheets. I guess... I guess like residential... You know, your residential piping in your house is copper, but... Y these big industrial things, that would be made out of steel, not copper. Uh... But we'll just make, I don't know how many we're going to actually need. So let's just make 60. Yeah, okay. I, I, and also I'm probably going to have to make one of those pumps, right? Uh, what are those costs? Oh, I can make that. We're fine with that. Okay, cool. Is the coal, the coal's here. Yes, look at that. Wow. That's like, I could have just brought it straight down and over. Um, let's just see how this works. Because I've never done this type of thing before, like the, the coal business. So I'm actually going to set it up down here and we're actually going to fill in this one hole because for some reason it was never <laughs> filled in in the beginning. Okay, cool. So let's place, um, let's see, let's place our water extractor. I think these things are massive too, right? Oh my gosh, look how big that is. That's the output. Wow. Like, I mean, it's not really lined up to anything. I don't know how to line it up. Jeez, look at the size of these things. What the heck? That is insanely big. Wow. Of course, they do need power, right? Um, so we can just run that to there for now. 
That's one thing in this game. Everything is, is they actually floating or is it more stationary and just looks like it's floating? Oh, it is floating. That's cool. All right, and then the coal. Let's put the coal generator. So that has coal. It, that's so weird. Why is it? Both inputs are on the same side, which makes it very difficult to do anything. Um, let's set it up like this. Um, how about even putting it here? here lining it up with that kind of grid and then we can actually hook the power these th look at the size yeah back when i again first started pl or when i played this the coal generators th there's no way they were this big like I, I mean if i may be wrong here but i don't believe they were anywhere near that big all right so pipes uh what would that be under i think we need to make a support um where is this going to come up at actually it's going to come up here can you line that up somehow or is that does that not really work i guess we could do it like that and then let's grab the pile i don't know how these how do these how do these things snap do they snap decent look at that they do snap and i don't know if we need a pump because i don't know if this is higher than 20 meters and then i think you just basically take this and just go whoop all right, and then we got to bring the coal. Wow, this is so crazy. Like, I wonder if you could do designs. I know how you could, I bet you how you could, how do you get, seriously, how do you get under this? Can you run under it? No. What? You should be able to slide under that, right? Yes, okay. Now, one thing I haven't, I've never used yet is these, uh, the conveyors. Look at that, that is cool. And then you would just go, look at that. That's how you could do it. And you could run, um, is that four? You could run a splitter. Do they hook right into that or no? They, you have to kind of do it from the ground, I guess. Uh, what do we gotta do? Oh, we don't have enough belt That's for, oops. Um, we're gonna need more. Hello, moon. Where is the moon at that is shining that way? That, I guess? Well, it doesn't matter. We're getting somewhere here, guys. We are s totally getting somewhere. And um, oh no, I'm out of raw. Okay, I'm out of I'm out of rods and I'm out of plate. But before this episode ends, which we were getting, to, that's a cool shot. Wow, look at that. As we're gonna get some plate, and we're gonna get some plates, and we're gonna get some. Are we not making rods at all? No, we have to be right. Looks like we're not making rods at all. Uh-oh. Because didn't... No, these are running fine. Okay. I think I just switched one of these to make plates for some reason. Oh, I did. And I bet you that's not working now. Shoot. That's why. This has to be... Um, making rods. Uh, eesh, okay. Um... Yeah, right, they need rods. Uh, can I grab that last one? How can I grab that one? I should be able to grab that, right? Yes. I just gotta grab all of these before they go in. Okay, here come the rods, so we're fine now. Last one. Oops. Alright, so we just gotta make a bunch of rods, which is fine. We gotta make... Uh, we, have, we have a bunch of plate, we just need a bunch of rods. Because for the power, I think, is what we needed, right? Wasn't that the issue? Okay, we're good now. Yes, this is great. This is so awesome. Zoop. I say zoop. It should be zoop. Is. We're going to grab that. And we're going to put that right about here. We're going to tie that into this. And hopefully our power doesn't just... Whoa. What? What the heck just happened there? What did I hit? What the heck that was? Did you guys see that? I don't even know what button I hit. It shouldn't have killed the power because it's not going to anything. That kind of worried me a little bit. And we're really gonna, just going to run this um, as far down as we can. Yeah, because this isn't going to fire up until there's coal present, right? How far can we go? Um, is that... How, where are we at here on this lined up business? There. 
And then here, we're going to have to go... I know this isn't like... I just want to hook it up to this. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. How do I get on top of this thing? Look at the size of this thing. Like, what? Like, for real. <laughs> it's freaking ridiculous. Okay, can you climb that? So as soon as the coal... Look at that, it's pumping water. <laughs> no power. Uh, you can't put that in there, can you? You gotta put... So... Okay, so here... It consumes 45 cubic meters of water per minute. Um, so I guess the question, where's the coal at? I just want to wait. I want to see once how much these guys put out. So I think, I'm pretty sure the ratio is kind of a bit wacky. Look at the size of this. This is just, look at that. That's, it's just so crazy, the size of these things. All right, we're almost there. <clears throat> actually did that actually connect to that I don't know how those work it must be because I can't snap to it here we go can you see the conveyor belts moving or does that not work as soon as the coal gets in here it's going to fire up yes okay so this uses 15 coal per minute which is kind of a good thing now we know that because this belt can do 60 so one yellow belt Wait, no, what? No power. Uh, what? Is this not hooked into anything? Uh, what? What am I missing here? There's coal in it. There's zero water. Why is there no water? Um, I don't want to jump down there, though. Why is this not working? Let me flush it out. Is that doing anything? I think I need to put one of those pumps. Oh no. Is it going to drop? You can throw 300 a minute. Oh, we're working now. I think it's just because it was empty and it wasn't, it wasn't push. Oh no. Is it going to die? Oh, it's okay. No, it's not. Ooh, is that just gonna die? Cause this should stay consistent, right? I don't know if that's gonna work. Let's just let's just watch it. Hmm. I think we need to put one of those pipes. Or one of those, what are they called? <clears throat> oh yeah, because it just died. Okay, so we need to put a pump in. And they take two rotors. So we need to make two rotors. Which we should actually be able to grab the two rotors from over here. <clears throat> I think it's this one here that's making the rotor. No, this one's making the rotors. Is there two at least? Yes. Awesome. Now I'm assuming that this pump needs power. Which, of course, is going to need power, right? Okay, so... We'll put one of the pump things in. I think we need to put that in because I guess this is higher than 20 meters. I don't know how to tell that. But if we put it... Can you turn that? Does this matter which way this faces? So if I put it here... Is that basically showing me... Oh, so showing me there it's, it goes a lot faster than putting it... But I don't understand. I don't know where like the limit is here, but where to put it? Because this pumps vertically. Let's put it here, I guess. I don't know. Does this matter? Shouldn't, right? Let's just hook this up to power. Uh, there we go. What's the flow? Oh, I see. I think when this should be... Yeah, okay. Alright, I get how that works now. So, these little things down here, these ring things, 
when these are these when these are fully expanded, the pipe is completely full. Now our flow rate isn't that high, but I don't know if that really matters. Like the Yeah, I think that's what that means. Now, should we have put the, this pump higher? I don't, I don't know how that... I, I'm, I'm not too up on how the pumps work. Um, oh, here we go. So, it's lifting 7.8. Recommended max is 20. So, I guess from where this pump is up to here, it would be 7 meters, 8 meters. So, this should be... Yeah, it's not even lifting at its maximum thing. So, this should be... I don't know if the flow rate actually matters. There's, there's, this is completely full. And this is like completely, does this spin? What's the animation on that? Well, I guess the deal, right, is the coal burns the stick. Like well, it burns. It, it makes steam out of the water. And then it's like more like a, a steam generator than a coal generator. Because you're not generating power with coal, per se. You're using coal to boil water. But you know what? This is awesome. So our power problems as of right now are solved because based on this, I think I can put at least three more on here on the belt of copper or the belt of coal and then we'll have to figure out the water business. That is so loud. Can you hear that? But this is awesome. It's working. Look at that. Cool. All right, guys, this was a very productive episode. We made our way over to the coal without dying or much at all. Well, we didn't die hardly at all. We lost a couple, I guess, 2.2 and a quarter bars, I guess. But uh, please join me next time when we're going to be migrating over here. I think this is what we're going to do. We're going to use this area. Let's get away from this thing because it's so loud. We're going to use this area here to generate power and also to probably have the space elevator. We may move this, but to have that there. And then on this end down here is basically smelt everything um, over here. So you've got the two iron nodes, you've got the copper node, and you have limestone smelt everything over here. And then over here, if you remember, as you went up this thing, over on this bridge, there's three limestone nodes. So basically get all that going so we can have a big supply and then start setting up, I guess, some bus networks, which means you really need to up our iron supply, our iron production, and, and everything. But please join me next time for that. Uh, comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification button if you enjoyed this episode, which we made progress today. I'm very happy if you can hear my voice. We got coal power, and that's like a huge like step to producing because you don't have to worry about power anymore, relatively speaking. Thanks for watching, guys.